my name is Trinity Aeronaut, and I am very excited to speak to you from the new Re Linden Reveal. And I have to say, these moles, these Linden moles are upping their game with every single new reveal. These are quite beautiful and something I was hoping that they would do this year. And I'm going to show that to you. First, I'd like to tell you what I'm wearing. My hair is from Tram. My, uh, my jumpsuit is from uh, uh, Loud Rebel Yell. And it is um, at the Sense event. The shoes are from um, Encore. My nails are from Alma. There will be a list from uh, on my uh, blog, so that uh, you can uh, you can go ahead and get some of these items. And since we're done with that, I'm going to go ahead and take you and show you the different builds. This here is the first build. Um, I noticed that all the insides are white. I'm not 100% certain if there will be a, um, uh, a, a, a decorator a button in here. It doesn't look like there is. I, I thought I saw one in one of them, but uh, I've noticed that there don't seem to be any. Uh, so anyway, this is the first floor. As you can see, these rooms are generous in size. And you've got, obviously in here, I would use this room as a kitchen. I would use this room as a dining area or a eating area. And I would use this part here as a living room. Uh, and each of these houses are equally large in size um, or bigger. and. Uh, so upstairs we've got, looks like, one room and a balcony. Isn't this beautiful? This is so beautiful. Okay, this is the first house. Let's move on to the second house. Now I can see from the outsides that these are, it looks like the outsides are going to be different colors. Um, so I, I'm thinking that probably we will be able to decorate. I'm just not sure how. This is the second cabin. As you can see, there's a nice long front porch on it. And it is very much low to the ground. And then in here we've got, looks like, Two, two rooms over here. This room in here is a smaller one. Again, I think this is going to be a kitchen. I think it would make a great kitchen. This room will be a, an eating room, maybe a dining room, I don't know, maybe a small sitting room. Not sure. Not sure what this will be. And then this will be obviously a bigger room. It's going to be a living room. Wouldn't this be a beautiful place to have a fireplace? I think a fireplace in these houses would be absolutely beautiful. So let's go up and I want to show you the second floor. And again, we've got two rooms up here. We've got a small bedroom. I bet you this would make either a nice uh, baby baby's room if you're so inclined or a bathroom if you're so inclined and then this would be an awesome um, master bedroom I think it's big enough okay so that's this let's go over to the third house we'll, oh and here we go look at this see this is this is what I was looking for I didn't see it in the other house, but it, it is here. I'm wondering, well, this is this hasn't even been opened yet, so I'm wondering if maybe they just they'll when they open it, they will have uh, they will have those those all in it in all these houses. Let's move on though. This house is up, but this house is very nice as well. Okay. 
this is a, a different kind of house, as you can see. We've got a, a large room here where the door where the you come in. Then we've got a smaller room over here and an attached smaller room. Again, I think this would make a great kitchen. This would make a great dining room. This would make a great living room. Let's go upstairs and see what we've got. This would obviously also make a great bedroom. And again, we've got this gorgeous piece out here. And the house we were just in over there, look at that back porch. That's an awesome back porch. Front porch and back porch. This does not have a front porch. It may, however, have a back porch. Let's go look this. Okay. Does it look like there is a back door here? So I think what we've got is a, what what you're seeing is about all we've got. Okay, so we're out of here. Now I'm very excited about this next house. It is absolutely stunning from the outside. Right here. I also love this beautiful kind of slate blue color. It's just gorgeous. And I'm thinking it's going to be, the main door is going to be right in through here. But imagine a porch swing up here. And maybe a couple of Adirondack chairs over here. Wouldn't that be beautiful? Oh, love it. Love it. And as you can see on the inside with the light, with these wind lights, you've got this gorgeous, um, shadowing on the uh, on the floor from these windows which let in so much light and you've got a large room here you've got a smaller room over here and again an even smaller room here kitchen dining room sitting room or whatever kind of a slash sitting dining room and then this could be a, you know, whatever you want it to be. Could be a living room. Could be I don't know. And of course you could, if, if you find a corner fireplace, it would look really fantastic over here. Or maybe one of the wood stoves. Gorgeous. And then up here we've got a smaller kind of uh, just a one room this is just uh, like a loft for your bed so I think we've seen at least two lofts up here I'm not sure I know there is a there's going to be a different house I think this might be it I think this might be the fourth house honestly I'm not sure how many of them are here it looks like there's a lot but they may be this like, there may only be four different types, and they just repeat themselves. Okay. We've got a rather large sitting room here, which would make a great place. This would make a great wall for a fireplace. Then you've got a second room here, which would make... A nice sitting room could make a nice dining room. Um, and then you've got a smaller room over here, again, which would make a nice kitchen. I mean, that could be a great kitchen. This could be a dining, I don't know. Just, uh, who knows? I mean, do we really need a formal dining room in SL? Maybe, maybe not. Let's go up the stairs. I'd like to show you what's upstairs, and I believe this room, this build, has a little surprise upstairs. And I'm hoping that this, yes, this is it. We've got a nice big landing here. Might make a great sitting area, someplace quiet to read or or sleep on a I don't know on on, on a um, a bed of some kind. And it's got, as you can see, a third floor. So these, this is a smaller room. This could be a bathroom or a baby room. This could be a child's room or a master bedroom. And we've got a 
another room up here with a beautiful long seating area there that would look great with a cushion and some a cushion that has some seating in it wouldn't that be beautiful a nice quiet place to come and you or if you've got house guests you could put quite frankly a bed in each one of these kind of uh, um, arms or whatever you know just just you've got three of them three three arms three beds or three in in dents three three places to, to sleep people so or you could do anything you know you want to make turn this into an attic that looks like an attic you could do that if you're if you're wanting a good dose of reality it's up to you to keep it clean Okay, so let's go ahead and get out of here. I believe this is the last house. There were only four houses. La the last two times, the last two or three reveals, I've only had four. I'm not 100% certain that that's all this has, but we'll find out. We're going to go ahead and go over and get to some of these other ones and see. And of course, look at the landscaping and listen with the birds and the ducks and this beautiful little little um, crossing here to get from one side of this to the other just beautiful just gorgeous you can hear the water and the ducks look at all the plant life flora and the fauna just gorgeous just beautiful it's basically you've got the four models and they're quite beautifully set apart I think that uh, they're on 1024 lots so there's plenty of space and if these are decorated there as they are here then I don't think we're gonna have to add a lot of points out out in them which leaves us plenty of land impact to put inside. This is Trinity Aeronaut. I am over here. I've gotten over here before the crowds come home because I've been coming over here every day looking for this. And I've gotten here, I've gotten this filmed, and before the rush. If you've enjoyed this video, please like it. Uh, and subscribe to my channel and I will see you again for the next SL event or fashion or show or whatever whatever in piques my interest I'm sure it'll pique yours bye